Oh, this is gonna be worse. Yeah, I feel intoxicated. I might say um, anything at some point. So. But I'm gonna smoke weed, so. So. Talk to me. I don't even know how to break this shit down because this shit wild crazy. Um. I. Uh, picture going to work and your bus get hijacked. No. And on a hot, high speed police chase. Over an argument on the bus. Oh, nah. I ain't with it. You ain't with it? Oh, we crashing that bus. I'm snuffing a nigga. I don't oh. got patience like that. This like, this like, you know the movie Speed? You ever well, seen he had a gun or a bomb? Not a gun. No, he, well, he kind of right, took the see. gun. Let's see. Let's talk about it. Let's get to it. Morning, the GBI confirms the hijacking started with a fight between Greer and another passenger who had a gun. Investigators say Greer took that man's gun, then fatally shot him. 11 Alive's Ariana Menise is joining us live outside the Fulton County Jail. Ariana, so much new information coming in in the last couple of hours. We've heard from other passengers on that hijacked bus. We do know Greer decided not to appear in court. So walk us through all the... He said, I ain't got time for this shit. Like, wait, time. Why you clip that? Oh, shit, yo, nah. I ain't, though, I'm calming down because, like, I, I got to get to back to what the argument. What is the uh, I have no idea. They didn't even say it. You said it was an argument. Niggas out here is too wild, bro. Got the gun. Now, he pulled it out on you, probably. You taking and shoot him, and you still gonna hijack the bus? That was kind of like self defense. I don't know what what that. This what? is Fulton County Jail. That's in that's in Atlanta. Atlanta guns is legal. Wait, is, do they got to stand that, your ground? That's why I said something don't make no sense. Yeah, they got to stand your ground. Something don't make no sense. Okay, let's see. These new developments. And Cheryl, we learned that a moment we pulled into the parking lot here at the Fulton County Jail facility and we were able to talk to passengers who were on board that bus. While they could not detail exactly what happened during that chaotic ride, they tell us that they're still in shock, but also just speechless. Joseph Greer is in custody facing several charges for allegedly hijacking this Gwinnett Transit bus at gunpoint oh, and shit. holding passengers yeah. hostage. That was a police car here. Thank the BLI. Yeah. Yeah. It, it was crazy, it was chaotic. Mm -hmm. uh, glad to be here. Paulette Gilbert and Akbar Kiyahi were among oh, the yeah, 17 yeah, passengers on board during those terrifying moments. Both left speeches about what they experienced. We just can't talk about it. Oh, yeah. This was a regular bus, right? Transit is regular. Man, city bus. why he was um, why he uh, why man? Listen, I don't know, man, because them people look suspicious to me. Fuck that. So why why he had kidnapped that bus? It, it was true. It was true. He shot the nigga. Probably scared. Something like, oh shit. Like the GBI says the chaotic ride started around 4:30. So he Tuesday shot a nigga on the bus. The yeah, bus he took his gun. On Ivan Allen Boulevard in downtown Atlanta and got into an argument with the passenger. Investigators say the passenger pulled out a gun. Greer then took the gun, threatened others on board with the firearm, and shot the passenger. He then ordered the bus driver to flee the scene at gunpoint. Forced the bus driver to drive off. The 11 Live Sky Tracker followed the bus as it drove onto oh, the downtown cars, connector yeah. during rush hour Pause on I-85 North. Yeah. All right, so what I think happened is he might have been intoxicated or out of it. He probably was wilding on the bus. Somebody on the bus had the pistol. And was like, I'm about to calm this nigga down, but he really wasn't about that smoke. Because if he was about that smoke, he wouldn't have disarmed him. He'd have shot him. Mm -hmm. Son took the shit, but he already in the mental state of I'm bugging. He know he bugging. So at no point did he think he was right. It probably wasn't like he was sitting there with his headphones and son yeah. started harassing him. Because he just got the whole vibe and he going the distance of somebody that that fuck around and um that fuck around and, and, and like he might have watched. You know what I'm saying? And um once he got that gun now i understand yeah. the difference in like because like i hope they ain't going over no rocky areas like what if this nigga turned the bus off this this like man listen. he hit two police cars yeah he was on one hitting dozens of cars multiple dozens. law enforcement agencies pursued the bus the cat police ended the chase in stone mountain along q how road you saw the collective effort and dedication of law enforcement working today to save lives 
to rescue hostages to make sure this ended. Police say the passenger rear shot was taken to the hospital where they died. Rear was taken into custody and charged with murder, 11 counts of kidnapping, 14 counts of aggravated assault, oh, the possession of a firearm or mad. knife, and possession of a firearm by a convicted felon. Why they so and the driver the, police well, say they, they are shaken up, applauding them for their bravery. Trying to navigate what was a gunman with a gun to the head of a bus driver saying, don't stop this bus or else worse will happen. I mean, this seems like the movies. It's a scene passengers say they will never forget as they're thankful to live through this and be reunited with their that family. But as of right now, still of uncertain if they'll ever take the bus after an unforgettable day. Mm -hmm. Emotional distress. Well, now they gonna go to Rosa Parks mm -hmm. or the bus. Yeah. <laughs> no, nigga, <laughs> they're walking. We'll find out. We'll they gonna have a car yeah. soon. With our families. Not this week for sure. Now, the GBI says they're withholding the name of the passenger that was killed on that bus until next again is notified. Reporting live from the Fulton County nigga? Jail, I'm Mariana huh? Menace for 11 Alive. Back to you. Who's the nigga? Who? That got killed? That was a black nigga they was taking. That, that guy that, they, that shot up the bus. Was he a crazy nigga? They, they, um, they said that he told them that he was off his meds for like a couple of weeks. So... If he was off his meds, and they know he needed the meds, should the consequences be lighter? What was the reason why he was off his meds? Did he decide not to take them? Because a nigga that's crazy might be off their meds. Yeah. They need somebody around them that care America, about them. America, like, we don't allow, health like, issues, number one problem. Yo, Only in America. Yo, we don't want some of these old, wild things that humans used to do to continue because we feel like we're more developed and more intelligent. But it once was a time when when you couldn't keep up, you couldn't keep up. Your parents wasn't going to keep you as retarded. Now, nigga, you homeless. We don't need no retarded kids. You cannot help, ever. You going against the grain, we're going to need you to get the fuck up out of here. All right? Okay, he born deformed or he not going to be, yo, we might have to kill him. This me, like, whatever the reason was, but we feel like we progress as a society. So we be like, yo, nah, no abortions. Fuck that shit. So everything is coming in. Some of this shit... Maybe shit, let me not say some, man, there are times when you could see it in the parents, like, this motherfucker is retarded. That motherfucker is retarded. They young, and they gonna traumatize. Imagine if they did some wild shit, like, I don't even wanna say that, like, forced adoptions, like, yeah, you can't keep it. People are like, no! Girl, don't you know you gonna traumatize this kid? Imagine if they was like, you know what? We're not going to do the abortion thing, but we're going to do the forced adoption. When we know you're going to traumatize the kid, mm -hmm. you ain't keeping that kid, my nigga. That would be some of the wildest shit. Hell yeah. People go crazy. Well, so I'm done with this topic, kids. make it. You do what you want to do because no, I just no, took I'm it done. somewhere else. I'm no, good. No. I, I don't care. I can go. Oh, man. I, I relax. That, it is crazy to me. Fuck but, niggas talking about. Unfortunately, he couldn't get his meds and wowed out. I think that.